Okay. Hello, hello, guys. Hello, good evening. Good evening. evening. How are you guys? How are you today? How did you feel today? Today, that is week number four. So, guys, we have been in a long vacation, right? Because we didn't have classes two days, right? So, perfect, guys. Let's see. Uh, well, we, we didn't have class due to Independence Day, right? And because the president authorized another day, right? So, guys... Let's see. Uh, let's wait a couple of minutes for the rest to join. So, guys, let me share you, okay, with you the platform. So, I guess everybody finish, okay, the exam and the session three, right? Everybody, ya todos terminamos esta sección, right, guys? Yes. Yes. Perfect, guys. So let's see. Uh, well. Do we have any question about the exam, guys? About the things that we have to do there? Yes, no. Probably an exercise that you didn't understand or something. Algo del examen, chicos, que no hayan entendido. Yes, no. Everything was clear. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. So, no. <laughs> okay, perfect. That's pretty cool. So, guys, let me you know. Just take a look about this one. So the exam, guys, the first part was just the listen, right? So this one, you only have to decide what was the correct one. So I hope everybody could do this. This was very easy, right? Then the second example, guys, was about do or does question, right, guys? Yes or no question. You only have to choose what was the correct one, right? So just like this one. If you see, it's very short, right? Also, guys, we have this one. Uh, some of you, they have, okay, inconvenience with this exercise, right? A scramble. You only have to guess what was the correct, okay, sentence. And then we have this one that was, you know, about profession and jobs. You remember that we were discussing about this one. Places to work and also what do they do, right? And well, also we have, okay, with, Equations, right? How to create equation and how to answer. So, guys, let's see. Let's you know take a look at this one. The first one say, "I work at the restaurant." So, guys, what was the correct answer for this one? Where? Yes. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where do you work? Donde trabajas? I work at the restaurant. Trabajo en un restaurante. Perfect. Now this one, right? He's a firefighter. What do you think, guys? What does he do? What does he do? Perfect. And what is the meaning of this question in Spanish, guys? Exactly. Cool. Yeah, very nice, guys. Perfect. And then we have the last question. They hate their jobs. What do you think is the correct answer here? Yes? How do they like how their, do they their like jobs? jobs? Okay, how do they like their jobs? Perfect. Cool, guys. So, well, this was, you know, pretty much the part of the exam. Well, in the last part was just a conversation, right? So, I think, girl, you remember, guys, that we saw this one has an interesting job, okay, like this one. So, well, guys, if anybody has any question like this, that's pretty cool, guys. So, well, let's see, okay, it's already 8 p.m. So, welcome, guys, welcome to this class. So, today we are going to start unit number four, right? But, guys, because we didn't have classes, okay, two days, okay, we didn't see some topics, okay? So now, guys, let me, you know, give you a refresh about these topics, okay? Because this is very important for you to learn, okay? So let's see. We have, guys, this part, okay? This part, you remember? So a firefighter's job is dangerous, okay? A firefighter has a dangerous job, remember? We have these adjectives, right? Adjectives. And also, okay, 
we made an exercise okay, using this kind of adjectives. But guys, besides that, we also have different adjectives, right? Tenemos más adjetivos que solo esos. So guys, para el trabajo, tenemos estos tipos de adjectives, right? So demanding, demanding, okay? Is, this is a job that requires a lot of your time and energy, okay? Un trabajo demandante, demanding, right? Que requiere mucho, okay, de su tiempo y energía. Challenging, okay? This is a very good, a very difficult job, right? Un trabajo que pone bastantes retos, right? Repetitive, okay? Tipo de trabajo rewarding, okay? Rewarding means like, um, como que los premia, okay? Que premia cada vez. Glamorous job, lonely, okay? A lonely job means un trabajo donde trabaja uno solo, right? Un trabajo donde no mira muchas personas, right? Mundane, okay? A very ordinary job with no interest or excitement. And clerical, but also, guys, we have some phrases here, okay? Tenemos además de eso otras, okay? Uh, adjectives for job. We have a part-time job, okay? Un trabajo de medio tiempo, part-time. Full-time, un trabajo de tiempo completo, okay? A stressful, okay? Un trabajo estresante, right? Stressful. Challenging, okay? Demanding, repetitive, and modern, right? So guys, let's see, this is, you know, part of the adjectives, okay, that we, okay, are seeing right now. So let's see, I have guys here for you an exercise. So let's see, I'm going to choose some of you because I want to see how good we are in this part of adjectives, okay? So let's see. So guys, let's see, let me choose one of you. I'm going to choose Michelle. Hello, Michelle. Hello, teacher. Hi, Michelle. Can you describe this person for me, please? His appearance. Su apariencia, please. He's uh, handsome. Okay. He's handsome. Okay. What else? Mm. En ese momento se me olvidó cómo se dice sonriente. Smiling. Smiling. Okay, what about his hair, su cabello? It's, it's black, perdón. Okay, it's black, okay. Now let's see, let's choose Sergio Mendes. Hello, Sergio. Hello, teacher. Hi, Sergio. Help me describe his appearance, please. Uh, he is a black man. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, your eyes. Hair, hair or his eyes? Uh, uh, hair. His eyes. His eyes, his eyes, uh, son de color. Or... Um, um, well, I can see that his eyes are black or brown, right? You can see. Uh, brown, brown, sorry. Okay. Okay, perfect. Nice. Now, let's see. Let me choose Laura Molina. Hello, Laura. Hello, teacher. Hi, can you describe her appearance, please? Mm. Yes. Delgada, uh, thin, 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 okay. thin, and uh, yes, uh, large, hair large. Um, okay, a long hair, you can say. A long, uh-huh. Okay. Okay, let's see, guys. So, well, I see that some of you, we have forgot about how to describe people. So, well, guys, let's see here. If you see, we have some adjectives, right? So, let's see. We have height, okay? Tall, medium height, or short, right? Que tan alto es una persona, okay? Weight, okay, el peso. Tenemos fat, fit, or thin, right? 
age, tenemos la edad, chicos. Old, middle age, and young, right? Tenemos también el pelo, que el hair. Tenemos de color brown, dark, red. Y para rubio, guys, pelo rubio se dice fair or blonde, okay? Fair or blonde. Tenemos también un tipo de pelo. For men, it's peaky, right? El pelo que es como parado, right? Curly, okay? Colocho. Wavy, ondulado. Straight, liso. El pelo largo, long. Short y bold, que significa calvo, okay? Bold. También eyes, okay? Eyes, los eyes, chicos, los diferentes colores, right? Brown, green, blue. Tenemos small eyes and big eyes, ¿ok? Ojos pequeños y grandes. Face, la cara, chicos. Round face, cara redonda. Long face, oval. Y tenemos mustache, que ¿okay? Mustache, que es el bigote. Y bird, que es la barba, ¿ok? So, guys, I guess we know this vocabulary, right? Creo que muchos de nosotros conocemos un poco este vocabulario, right, guys? Yes, no. A little bit. Yes. Yeah, yes, teacher. Yes, okay. So, guys, let's see. This is part of adjectives, right? Esto es parte de los adjetivos. So, let's see, guys. Let's say, you know, a review about adjectives. So, we have this one. Kind woman and selfish man. What do you think is kind, guys? ¿Qué creen que es kind? El adjetivo kind. ¿Qué creen que significaría? Grande. Yeah, amable. Amable, yeah, gentil, right? Y selfish, what is selfish, guys? ¿Qué es selfish? Como egoísta. Mm -hmm. Egoísta, exactly. Selfish means egoísta. Now, guys, we have friendly. What is friendly? Amigable. Perfect. So, si friendly es amigable, ¿qué sería unfriendly, guys? No amigable, antipático. Exactly. No amigable. Cool. And we, uh, and we have honest, okay? Honest. And we have liar. What is liar, guys? Liar. This one. Mentiroso. Mentiroso. Exactly. Mentiroso. Cool. Liar, mentiroso. Well, we have also cheerful, que es como alguien, cheerful. okay? Con energía, cheerful. right? Serious. Tenemos responsible. Yeah. Irresponsible. irresponsible, hardworking. What is hardworking, guys, for you? Hardworking. Trabajador. Exactly. We have hardworking y lazy. Lazy, Sagan, and again, right? And so on, guys. <laughs> Now, let's see, guys. Let's move on, okay, to the part that is important for us describing people's appearance, okay? So, guys, let's start with the basic description, okay? So, chicos, cuando escribimos acerca del age, okay, la edad, el, la, los looks, right, el peso, el tipo de cuerpo, nosotros ocupamos el verbo to be. So, for example, guys, he or she is a teenager, he is young, he is middle age, he is elderly, okay? She is in, in her 20s, in her 30s, in his 40s, okay? Teenager, guys, is, well, you know, there's como adolescente, right? So, for example, he's young. How old is your, oh, yeah, how old is your, um, your brother? Well, he's young, right? So, and you mention all of this, right? Como adolescente, joven, de mediana edad y anciano, right? We also have looks, guys, los looks. Handsome, okay, as you mentioned. Good looking, attractive, pretty, beautiful, gorgeous, right? Y para head, guys, tenemos short, que hay alguien que es bajo, alto, muy alto. Y luego podemos utilizar también como around 165, okay? Dependiendo de cuántos metros usted tenga, right? Y now, guys, body type, el tipo de cuerpo, guys. Tenemos skinny. Skinny es como alguien que ya es como bastante delgado, que ya casi como calabérico, right? Thin es alguien que es delgado. Slender es también como alguien eh, que es como plano, right? Delgado. Well-built es como alguien que tiene el cuerpo bien trabajado. 
well, we have sexy, muscular, chubby guys, es otra forma de decir fat, ok, chubby es alguien como regordete, ok. Now guys, well, for completion, tenemos, ok, el tipo de eh, color de piel, white, fair, brown, tan, dark, ok, and we have, ok, this appearance, right, como el color del pelo, la cara, los ojos, also nose, que okay, la nariz, la boca, los labios, y tenemos mustache and beard, okay, el bigote y la barba, okay. So you see, this is like vocabulary that I guess everybody knows, right? So guys, uh, we have, okay, this very, you know, description, this description that you can see here, these are just examples, right? So now guys, let's see. La pregunta, guys, que siempre, ok, deben de preguntar para preguntar sobre la apariencia de alguien es What does y aquí, he or she look like, right? Y ustedes pueden decir, she's beautiful and young, ok, she's tall, sexy, right? So, ¿cómo preguntan para la edad, guys? Nosotros preguntamos how old is, ok, she or he, y luego respondemos like this, right? Para preguntar qué tan alto es alguien. How tall is she or he? La complexión. What is her or his complexion? You see? Like this one, right? Now, guys, let's move on to this part. Let's see Cesar. Hello, Cesar. Hi, teacher. Hi, Cesar. Can you help me describing these people, please? How does he look like? He is very tall. Okay. Uh, uh, he's short hair. He has short hair. Mm -hmm. Is medium age. Okay, he's medium age. Okay. Perfect. What about his hair? I'm hair. His hair. He has. El pelo. Brown mm, Liso, perdón, no, no, no recuerdo cómo dice liso. How do you say pelo liso, guys? You remember? O sería parado. Mm, well, in this case it's liso. So we say a straight hair, okay? Straight. A straight hair. Okay, very nice. Cool. So now, guys, let's move on to this one. Let's see, let me ask, who do I have? Selma, hello, Selma. Hello, teacher. Hi, Selma, tell me, how do you describe, what does she look like, tell me. Okay, uh, she's pretty. Okay, nice, what else? Uh, she mm -hmm. uh, lar large hair large hair oh long hair long hair long hair okay uh, what else she she brown eyes 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 okay perfect hey thank you Salem okay guys so well, I can see, okay, that some of you, I guess some of you, I mean, don't have a very, I mean, uh, good knowledge about how to use this one. So let's see, guys. Let me explain you guys. Let me explain this. Let's see how to describe this one. So let's see, guys. Primero, tenemos for a high, okay, high age and body, guys. Nosotros utilizamos el verbo to be. So, como, teacher, let's see. Tenemos esto, ok. Height, ok. El body, ok, que es weight. Y el hair. Also, no, hair no, is age, sorry. So, age. So, guys, let's see. Primero, high, guys, ok. For example, describamos a uh, my mother. Let's see. My mother, ok, is, y ahora, chicos, iniciamos con el primero, high. Tenemos tall. Medium, high, or short, right? Ustedes pueden describir de esta manera, okay? My mother is, let's see, short, okay? Perfect, we have the first one. Let's see, my mother, okay? 
is our age, guys. My mother is old, middle age, or young. So I can say my mother is middle, middle age. age. Oh. Okay. Now, guys, tenemos el otro. El otro es body. So body means, guys, como esto, okay? Weight, okay? La forma del cuerpo. So, guys, my mother is... Let's see, my mother is... Y aquí tenemos, okay? Uh, let's see, feet, okay? Feet is feet. You see? Like this one. In this one, guys, podemos ocupar I am, por ejemplo... Podemos decir, I am short. Uh, let's see, you are tall. Ok, guys. So, para esto, chicos, cuando estamos describiendo, ok, ya sea height, age, or body, nosotros utilizaremos el verbo to be. Ok. So, let's see. Let's uh, take a look with Jacqueline. Hello, Jacqueline. Hola. Now, Jacqueline, I need you to describe your father, please. Que describas a tu padre, solo describeme su altura, please. How tall is your father? Is tall. Okay, my father is my tall. My father is tall. Perfect. Ahora, su edad, so his age. Uh, 4 Now, guys, let's move on. Pero, ¿qué pasa cuando tenemos, ok, face, lo el resto, face, hair, and eyes? Guys, para esto, nosotros vamos a utilizar el have o el has. Otra forma de decirlo es utilizando el go también. Pero en eso no prestemos atención. En eso. So, guys, for example, tenemos, let's start with face. Face, tenemos round, long, and oval, right? So, let's see. I can say... My mother, okay, has, okay, recordemos, he has, right, has oval face, right? Now, you have, let's see, round face, right? You see face, tipo de face, right? You have round face, okay? Like this one, you see, guys? You have, you has. Remember que pueden utilizar esto, pero también si quiero puedo agregar el got. My mother has got, okay, oval face. You have got round face. El got, chicos, no significa nada. Okay? Ustedes pueden agregarlo si ustedes gustan o no, right? It doesn't matter anything. Now, guys, ya tenemos face. Ahora con el hair, guys, okay? Tenemos el hair que tiene más vocabulario, right? Tenemos el color, okay, la forma, y si es largo o no. So, let's see. My mother has long hair. My mother has black my hair. Mother. Okay. My grandmother. Okay, my grandmother. O tú puedes decir, I have uh, blonde hair, pelo rubio, right? Blonde hair. Okay. You see, guys? Like yes. this. Now, también tenemos para eyes, guys. Yo voy a decir, my mother has brown eyes. You have green eyes. I have dark or, or yeah, dark eyes or black eyes, right? So, everything is clear so far, guys. Hasta aquí entendido. ¿Cuándo utilizaremos el verbo to be? ¿Para cuáles? Yes, no. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, perfect. Yes, teacher. Very nice, guys. So, well, now, let's see, guys. Now I have here, okay, because it is not only about that word, right? No solo es acerca de eso, sino que 
it's also about learning new vocabulary, okay? También es acerca de los adjetivos. So let's see. Let's start with this one, guys. So she has, okay, guys, iniciamos con esto, guys. ¿Cuál creen que sería? B. Letter B. B. Curly. Um, Brown. Letter B. Uh oh, in this case, it's A. Letter A. Se mira como curly. Si se mira como curly. Let's see this one. He has. He has. ¿Cómo se decía Calvo, chicos? He, he has a ball. Ball. Now, what about he is. Okay. Me está señalando a él. He is qué, chicos? Now he is what? He is fat. Now he is this one. She has B. Now this one, she has, has she has a long blonde, long, 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 exactly, long, 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 perfect, now guys, let's see, now I have here this exercise, okay, with only, okay, 10, okay, so this is just vocabulary, okay, this is solo vocabulary, okay, adjectives, so guys, this exercise, you are going to do it, okay, Este ejercicio okay. es para ustedes, okay? So let me share you, okay, the link with you here on the chat box of Zoom, okay? Aquí en el chat box de Zoom y también déjenme lo enviarse al grupo de WhatsApp, okay? So vamos a completar este ejercicio, chicos, okay? Lo vamos a realizar y al final solo me envían la captura de pantalla, okay, de cuántos se tuvieron con su nombre, okay? Let me send you right now. You can start now, okay, chicos. Este ejercicio es bastante easy, okay? está bastante fácil. Solo es acerca de vocabulary, okay? Solo son adjetivos. Ustedes deciden cuál es el adjetivo que le queda a cada uno, okay? So come on, guys, let's start. You have already the link, and if you have any question, you can let me know, okay? So if you have any question, guys, you can let me know, right? This exercise is just, okay, for you to understand and to get more vocabulary. Okay, so I have here, okay, Barbara, Michelle. Okay, perfect, very nice, girls, very cool. So that's cool. So we're going to wait, okay, for the rest. Come on, guys, this is very easy, right? You only have to answer this stem okay equations you only have to decide one okay what is the correct adjective in these cases okay so come on guys okay Evelyn okay perfect very nice okay guys so come on any question you can let me know okay these guys this is vocabulary right so, teacher. Yeah. Excuse me, teacher. 
Tell este, me. Mi internet, mi, mi internet lo tengo bien lento, teacher. No, no me ha caído todavía el en contacto el este. Uh, en, en el chat. No. Here, okay. Ana here. Olga. Uh, Ana Olga. Yeah, so Ana, I have already sent to the WhatsApp group. Okay, en el WhatsApp group. En el grupo de WhatsApp envié el link. En, what, aquí. en WhatsApp no, no me cae. Déjame enviarlo de nuevo, tal vez cae. Y si no, también aquí en el chat box de Zoom, ¿ok? Aquí en el chat box puedes también tener el link. Ahí está dos veces. Eh, es igual, no, lo, no te logra caer. Ana, eh, puedes hacerlo después, ¿ok? Cuando ya lo tengas. Cuando, pues, ok, ok, gracias. Thank you. Thank no worries. me cae. Okay, hey, I have okay. this one. Perfect, guys. I see that some of you have finished. That's very cool. Uh, let me mute. So, guys, for the ones that finish, let's see. We have the first one. So, what is this adjective, guy? What do you think? Think about. Think Perfect. Now, what about this adjective? All. 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 Perfect. Janos. Now, this All. one. All. Strong. 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 And what is strong, guys? Strong. Fuerte. Exactly. Fuerte. Now this one. B, thin. Thin, thin. Perfect. Thin. Now this one. Thin. Fat. Fat. Okay, perfect. Now this Fat. one. Tall. Hey, alguien grande. Alguien alto. Now this one. The girl is short. 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 Kenya, perfect. Now this one. Weak. 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 And what is weak? weak. Devil. 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 Perfect. Now this one. Heidi. 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 is alguien con mucho cabello, right? Heidi. Peludo. Exactly. <laughs> Pelu. Okay, yeah. Young. And now the last one. Oh. Young. Young. Very nice. Sí. Okay. So you see, guys, very Young. easy, right? It's not complicated. So perfect, guys. So we got it. So, guys, let's see. Do we have any question about these adjectives? Yes, no, a little bit. No. No. Everything's clear. Perfect. So, guys, let's see. We have, okay as well this one, but this one, guys, that will be okay for you, okay? So this one, guys, you can do it, okay? This is not evaluated, this is just for practice, okay? Le voy a enviar este link también, guys. Ustedes pueden hacerlo si ustedes gustan ya después de la clase. Right? Esto solo es para practice, okay? Para practicar su vocabulario in your English, right? You can do it gracias, after the teacher. class. So, perfect, guys. Now, let's see, guys. Uh, I have here a question, let's see. Tengo inter muy lento. Okay. So perfect. Do not worry, Alison. So perfect, guys. Let's see. Now that we have already passed that one, guys, let's move on. Okay. Now that you have, okay, some vocabulary, I want to see okay, how many of you can describe. Okay. Now it's time for you to tell me, guys, okay, to make this little game. Okay. So this one, guys, is in Spanish, right? The game is in Spanish. So let me, okay. In this case, guys, you're going to choose, okay, one of these characters, okay? Ustedes, chicos, van a escoger uno de estos, okay? Eh, una de estas personas. Y lo que van a hacer, chicos, es preguntarle, okay, a sus compañeros. Ustedes van a iniciar describiendo a la persona sin decir su nombre. Y sus compañeros tienen que adivinar cuál es, okay? This one. So, guys, let's, you know, put into practice this one. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm going to create, okay, some groups so you can... Ok, accept the invitation. Ya les envié la foto al grupo de WhatsApp, chicos. Así que practiquemos un poco, ok. Empecemos a describir, ok, a cada una de estas personas y tratemos de adivinarlas. Everything is understandable. ¿Todos entendió, guys? Yes. Yes. Perfect. So you can accept the invitation, please, guys, and go to their rooms.
Okay. Teacher, yo no estoy en ningún grupo. Uh, let me assign you to a group, okay, Evelyn. Uh, now, you can accept the invitation. Puedes aceptar la invitación. Envíela otra vez, porfa. Okay. Okay, Sergio, if you can accept the invitation, please. Teacher, a mí no me ha caído todavía. Tengo bien malo el internet, la señal. Mm, let's see. Uh, Ana Olga. Yo. Let's see. Uh, Revisa si ya le cayó. Eh, Siempre me saca, teacher, de la... Igual a mí. Y no, te, no, no, no me cae. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Well, what you can do, guys, eh, ustedes pueden, entonces, entre los que están aquí que no pueden aceptar, pueden iniciar haciendo este juego, ¿ok? So, sure. van a escoger okay. a una persona y pueden iniciar a escribir, ¿ok? I'm going to, ¿ok? Look for the rest of your class. Voy a ver los otros grupos con su clase. Ustedes pueden estar aquí. Eh, hacemos el de Britney Spear. Sí, yo digo que sí. No sé si ya tenemos que tener las preguntas como hechas. O hacerlas en el instante. Yo decía que así como hicimos el ejercicio hace un momento, o si con pregunta. Okay, so guys, are you practicing? Guys? Yo tenía una pregunta. Tell este, me. Um, tenemos que ya tener listas las preguntas para los demás compañeros. Eh, o... No, no. Eh, lo que se iba a hacer, iban a escoger un personaje y lo iban a empezar a describir con los adjetivos que ya conocemos. For example, she has blonde hair, she has pink hair, she has, she's white, she's black, ¿ok? Íbamos a describirlos okay. y las personas tenían que adivinar. But well, everybody's here right now, ya todos estamos aquí. So guys, welcome. Welcome, guys. Now, let's see. I'm going to choose some of you, okay? Some of you to describe me, okay? This one. So, let's see, guys. Um, I'm going to choose, uh, let's see, Jose Luis. Hello, Jose Luis. Hello, teacher. Hi, Jose Luis. Now, I need you. Necesito que escojas un personaje sin decir a nadie, solo... Diciéndome su descripción. Y todos vamos a adivinar quién es, ¿ok? Uh, ok, entendido. Ok, so let's start, José Luis. Eh, she have a higher brown and age and, and he have age. He have or he has? He has. Mm -hmm. He has age brown. And he, he has brown has, eyes. He has brown eyes and he has a mustache. Mustache. And, okay. Mm -hmm. And to wearing the a shirt. Okay. When he's wearing a shirt. Okay. In the in, in the skin has a uh, white. Okay. He okay. He's white. Okay, guys, who is? Tomás González. 
Hey, I'm asking Sunday. Yes, yes, profe. Okay, perfect. Very nice. Very cool. Now, let's see. Uh, Ruth, Ruth Chicas, hello. Hello. Hello, Ruth. Now, Ruth, it's your turn. Choose a character here and start to describe it, okay? Okay. She's um, middle age. Okay, she's middle she's age. She's a blonde and a blonde ha hair. She has. A blonde. She has, she has blonde, mm -hmm. blonde, blonde hair. Blonde hair. Mm -hmm. Blonde hair. She has green eyes. Okay, she has green eyes. Perfect. Um, she has skin white. Okay, she she has white skin. Okay, guys, who is she? King Asaya, guys. Britney. Britney. Is Lady. it Britney? Ruth. Lady Gaga. Lady <laughs> Britney. It's Britney. Britney. Spears. Okay, perfect. Very nice. <laughs> Good. Thank you. Now let's see. Let's start with Barbara. Hello, Barbara. Hello, teacher. Now, Barbara, this is your turn. Choose a character, please. Uh, okay. Um uh, she he's she, she, he, no, she is mm -hmm. a old woman. Okay, she's an old woman. Mm -hmm. She has gray hair. Gray hair, okay. Uh, she is, she has um, green eyes. Green eyes, okay. Uh -huh. Green eyes. So who is she, guys? Queen, eh. Queen Elizabeth. Era porque ya se murió. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Barbara. Thank you. Okay, guys. So you see, that's how you can. That's how you. How can you describe people, right? Esa es la forma en la que ustedes pueden describir. Now, guys, it's my turn. Okay. It's my turn. I'm going to okay describe a character. Now, guys. Voy a describir un carácter, chicos, y ustedes van a tener que adivinarlo, pero lo van a tener que escribir, ¿ok? Van a tener que escribir quién es, ¿ok? Aquí en el chat box, y la persona que adivine, ¿ok? Va a ser la ganadora. So, let's see. The character, let's see. Um, he has, well, he's old. He has uh, gray hair. Okay? He's white. Okay, guys, who is he? Quien es él o ella? Okay, guys. Okay, who was the first one? Uh, okay, Barbara Sebastian, exactly, Sebastian, perfect. Now, guys, let's see. Now, uh, let's see. She is white. She has a crown. And she's wearing earrings. Okay, guys. Britney Spear. Mm, no, you have to type it. Okay, Michelle say Reina Isabel. Yes, exactly. So I say, guys, she is white. Okay, ella blanca. She has a crown. Tiene una corona, a crown, and she's wearing earrings está eh, usando aritos right perfect guys so well let me ask you guys do you have any question about describing people so far yes no tienen alguna pregunta de cómo describir personas yes no a no okay guys so remember guys this is a class that you had in the past right esta es una clase que ya tuvieron right in previous modules but well guys let's see Let's move on. And now, guys, we are going to start, let's see, unit number four. Okay, let's see. Everybody has finished this section number three. Right? Ya todos terminamos unidad number three, right, guys? 
So let me ask you, how was the exam? ¿Cómo estuvo el examen, chicos? It was easy or it was difficult? ¿Cómo estuvo el examen, chicos? Easy. 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 Okay, so you see. It's very hard for me. I don't remember. Really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ah, <sí>. <laughs> okay, guys. So you see, it's not complicated, right? No es tan complicado porque son los mismos ejercicios que ya hemos realizado, right? So you don't have to worry about the exams, okay? No se tiene que preocupar mucho, right? But remember that we have to finish, right? Recordemos que tenemos que finalizarlos. So guys, in this week, en esta semana, chicos, vamos a estar trabajando in this unit number four, okay? Así que, no se apresuren, right? Because toda esta semana la vamos a tomar para esto, okay? If you see, we only have three exercises for this one. Solo vamos a tener tres ejercicios para esto, okay? So you don't have to worry about it. So now, guys, let's see. Let's just start, okay, with the things that we have for this unit, okay? So guys, we are going to start talking about food, okay? So this is a very interesting topic, okay? So if you see, we have a food pyramid here. So let's just start with the bottom to the top, from the bottom to the top. Let's see, we have grains, guys. For grains, what do we have? We have bread, cereal, crackers, rice, noodles, and pasta, right? Now, we have vegetables. What do we have for vegetables? We have lettuce, carrots, broccoli, tomatoes, and potatoes. We have fruit. For fruit, we have bananas, oranges, strawberries, apples, and mangoes. We have dairy. What is dairy? Do you know what is dairy, guys? Dairy? Lactose? No. Exactly. Some productos lactose. Exactly. So we have yogurt, cheese, milk, okay? And we have meat and other protein. So we have fish, beans, chicken, nuts, beef, and eggs. And then we have the last one. We have fat, oil, and sugar. Potato chips, candy, cream, butter, or oil, okay? So this is very, okay, come on. Now, guys, I need you, okay? You are going to help me right now. So my question for you guys, what's your favorite food, okay? So I need you to tell me what's your favorite food on, on WhatsApp, okay? And WhatsApp, chicos, necesito que me escriban cuál es su favorite food, okay? So everybody, please tell me, what's your favorite food? Todos quiero que me escriban, okay? What's your favorite food, okay? In English, of course. I need you to type me, okay? En el chat de WhatsApp, sorry. Tell me, please. What's your favorite food? Okay, guys, in my example, let's see my favorite food, guys. For me, it can be pizza, you know? I really enjoy pizza. So what about you guys? Hey, Brenda, say bananas, okay? Scissors are mangoes, okay, nice. My favorite fruit is a strawberry. Okay, very nice, guys. Now, what about you guys? Come on. It's a spaghetti, okay. Okay. Okay, well, that's nice. Oh, um, tortilla soup, perfect, I like it. Okay, guys, cool. So, well, everybody's typing, that's very nice, guys, so, cool. Now, guys, let's see, let's move on, okay? And let's see what do we have, okay, for this vocabulary, okay? Let's see. Let me move on, guys. And let's see how good we are, okay, with vocabulary about food. So, guys, let's start, okay, with this exercise. And you're going to tell me, okay, what's the correct one, okay? So, let's start with the first one. Guys, what is cheese? Tell me. Cheese. Cheese. Perfect. Nice. Milk. What is milk, guys? Hey. Yogurt. Well, yogurt, you know, right? This is the same as Spanish. Now, let's see. What about this one? Butter. What is butter, guys? Little B. Okay. Mantequilla. Exactly. Tomato. Well, tomato. 
Letters. D. 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 Carrot. Little C. Little C. Perfect. Corn. Little C. Potato. Little C. Little C. Onion. Grapes. Uvas. Orange. Perfect. Fish. Letter D. D. Exactly. Fish. Watermelon. D. Letter D. It's letter D, right? Letter, letter D. D. Now, banana. Well, you know what is banana, right? <laughs> letter C. Pineapple. What is pineapple, guys? Letter B. Piña, letter B. Style. It's not piña. Perfect. Pear. What is pear? A. Letter A. A. Letter A. Strawberry. What is a strawberry? A. 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 Eight. Avocado. What is avocado? B. 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 Okay. Very nice. Lemon. What is melon? B. Lemon. Letter B. Letter B. 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 Letter D. D. Tag. D. Chicken. Well, you know what is chicken, right? This is very Letter C. 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 Ham. D. What is ham? D. Ham. Letter D. Letter D. D. A steak. What is a steak? A. 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 Sausage. What are sausage? Exactly. Salchichas. Burger. What is a burger, guys? A B. Letter B. Perfect. Cake. Letter C. Letter C. Nice. Ice cream. Ice cream. Letter B. Letter B. Letter B. X. Letter C. Letter C. And the last one, fish. Exactly. Okay, guys. So I can see you have a very good vocabulary about this one. That's pretty cool. So it means that you know about food. Pretty cool, guys. That's excellent. Now, guys, let's see. I have it here, okay, for you this exercise. Well, let's see if that is for you. Let's see. So, guys, now is your turn to show me how good you are, okay? So, uh, let's see. Yes, we have time for this one. So, guys, we are going, okay, to make this exercise, okay? So, you're going to move, okay, the picture to the, okay, correct one. So, for example, guys, we have fish, okay? We have fish here, so I can, I have to look for the fish, right? So in this case, is here the fish, right? Fish, okay, fish. And then you have to move for the other ones, okay? Y luego ustedes tienen que mover los otros, right, guys? So guys, let's see, let's start with this exercise. It's very easy, okay? Tiene un poco, okay, de nuevo vocabulario, okay? So I hope some of you know, okay? So I have sent you, okay, the link to the chat okay here on chat um on the zoom chat and let me send you to the whatsapp group okay déjenme enviárselo al grupo de whatsapp también okay let's see so let's start doing this exercise please the only thing that you have to do is to move right solo at the move right so you have to select what it, what is pizza okay the pasta, mushrooms, vegetables, okay? You have to move it, right? You have to look as well at the picture. Tiene que ver también la, las fotos, okay? So you already have the link, okay? Ya tienen el link, guys. Está en el grupo de WhatsApp y también aquí en el chat box de Zoom, okay? Any question, you can let me know, okay? So come on, guys.
If you don't know a word, you can let me know, okay? Okay, let's see who has finished. Okay, Roxana. Okay, perfect, very cool. So, okay, Selma, very nice, Selma. Cool, guys. Michelle, cool, very nice. So, I see you have this vocabulary, guys, in your pocket. Very cool, guys. So, we are going to wait, okay, for the rest, okay? Okay, Barbara, very nice, guys. Okay, Roberto, cool, perfect. So guys, let's see this, okay, is one is very easy. I, it's just about vocabulary. Now for the ones that finish, para los que terminamos, chicos, let's move on to this exercise. I need your help, okay, necesito su ayuda. Let's start with the first one, chicos, necesito que me ayuden, fruit. ¿Qué diría en la lista de fruit, guys? Tell me. Orange. Orange, okay. Great. 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 Pineapple. Banana. Okay, let's see. Let me move on. Banana. Mm -hmm. Pineapple, mm -hmm. you say? Pear. Pear, okay. Uh, what, what is the pear? Okay. Melons. 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 Apple. Lem Apple. Okay. Lemon. Okay. Apple. Apple. Lemon. Apple. Okay. Um, what else? Melon. 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 Sorry, where is the melon? melon. So, melon. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Melon. Okay. What else, guys? The last one. Uh, plum. Plum. Okay. Plum. Now, guys, vegetables. What's vegetable, plum. guys? Vegetables. Onion. Yeah. Cucumber. Yeah. Cucumber. Plum. Bloom. Bloom is una ciruela. Oh, okay. thank you. Onion. Okay, oh, onion. You say onion. What else, guys? Cucumber. Tomato. Okay. Cucumber. Okay. Cor Carrot. Uh, eggplant. Tomato. Eggplant. Very Potatoes. nice. Potatoes. Potatoes. Corn. 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 Tomato. Sabash. Okay, tomato, cabbage, cabbage. What beans. else, guys? Beans. Beans. Okay. Now, guys, let's see. We have drinks. What do we have for drinks, guys? Apple juice. Water. Water. Juice. Meal. Water. Juice. Water. Meal. Okay. Water. Juice. Apple juice. Apple juice. Apple juice. Orange juice, apple cocktail, juice. cocktail. Orange juice. Apple, apple juice, juice. Ice. Apple, apple juice, juice. Coffee. coffee, coffee, okay. apple juice, cocktail, apple juice. Cocktail. 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 cocktail, okay, coffee, and then for dessert we have, okay, donut, we have the cake, the lolly, okay. Yes, 
the cooking, the dessert, some of the postres, okay? Chocolate. Chocolate, perfect. Oh, sorry, it moved. Ice cream. Bubble gum, bubble gum, it's chicken, right, guys? And the last one, ice cream. Ice. So let's see, guys. Very cool. So we got all of them, you see? So, guys, let's see. This is just for vocabulary, okay, guys? Esto solo es para que ustedes tengan un vocabulario, okay? So, guys, next class, okay, we are going to see some questions and the use of some and any, right? So, guys, si tienen alguna pregunta de la plataforma, right, o de algún ejercicio, you can let me know, okay? <laughs> eh, ustedes pueden iniciar en cualquier momento, right, hacer los ejercicios o esperar la clase, right? Si ustedes no lo saben cómo hacer, les recomiendo esperar, right? So, tomorrow, guys, we are going to start, okay, finishing some exercises. So, guys, nice to see you today, okay? We are going to finish right here. And if you don't have any question, it was a pleasure, okay, to be here. And I hope all of you have a good night, okay? So, guys, see you tomorrow and have a good night, okay? So, take care, Thank everybody. you, teacher. Bye. 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 Bye.